The 21 day challenge to get monetized update. I have never worked so hard on my own thing in my life. It is crazy. I put in 42 hours the first week. I am clocking hours this week. As I am going, I am learning and I am evolving and doing more and more. I did realize that these vlogs are not getting me views. The first three vlogs I did got me 40 views each. If I'm gonna get monetized in 21 days, I need to spend every possible minute creating content that's gonna get me subscribers. Instead of doing a vlog every day, I decided to make one vlog a week minimum. And also, I'm gonna try to make as many long format videos as I can, but it looks like that's gonna be around two a week. But I am sticking with one short every day. So every day, I get up, I make my short. Then I work on my long format video, and at the end of the week, I put together this vlog. With that said, this vlog has been so beneficial to me. In fact, if I was talking to a young YouTuber that was just getting started, or to myself right when I was getting started, I would say do a 21 day vlog. Make a vlog every day for 21 days. Edit it and post it. The reason being is this has gotten me out of my shell. I still have a hard time filming myself on camera and talking comfortably. And by doing this vlog, it has gotten me much more at ease in just setting up my camera and filming. And so I can say that even if it doesn't get a lot of views, it's gonna be super helpful for me to follow through and keep making some of these, to keep honing that skill and numbing myself to the fear that somebody's gonna judge me or be worried about what I'm doing. And by doing this, it makes content creation easier because now, instead of having to script everything out for a video, which is what I was doing up until now, I can just bullet point these ideas and then I film the script for my video just like I do a vlog and, and it seems like I can just talk off the top of my head a little bit easier than I, than I could in the past. I'd go so far to say the biggest barrier to my success is my ability to be myself on camera and capture that on film. One thing I do every day I scheduled one hour of time for research and development. And during that time, I study how to make money with a YouTube channel and how to make better videos. A couple of things that I have learned. One is I'm not doing enough research. For example, the video I just made today that I haven't published yet that I'm gonna be putting out tonight, I scripted this video, edited this video based on my imagination and what I thought was entertaining. The probably the most productive way to do it would be not to reinvent the wheel and try to create this out of my own brain. I should go out and find a bunch of YouTubers that are in my niche, that are making videos about diet, transformation, fitness, fasting, bodybuilding, working out, and then find a bunch of ones that are super successful, that have millions of followers, and find a bunch that are small, that don't have millions of followers and then study what they're doing. Find the best couple videos that I can find on what I ate in a day. Videos that were successful about what I ate in a day and got tons of views. For my next video, I'm gonna find a video on somebody training in their garage gym that got tons of views, and I'm gonna get ideas of what works, what caused that video to go viral, what caused it to get 100,000 views, and then implement some of those techniques in my video. The same thing goes for making money off of your videos. Uh, one of the tips I saw in my research was make a spreadsheet, list, the, list all the creators in your genre or in your niche and go to their pages and look at how they're monetizing their pages. See uh, what affiliates they're working with and how they are promoting themselves in their about page and through their videos. And then you can use that to give yourself ideas of how you can monetize your videos. I added one thing to my daily challenge and that is to play the guitar for 20 minutes. I did that during my fast and uh, I missed it. So by adding it in now to have a perfect day, I have to get at least 20 minutes of practice on the guitar in. So maybe I'll make a guitar video. I've only had two perfect days out of the last nine days. I am on track for another perfect day today, which will be my first back-to-back -back, uh, perfect days. Uh, and I, 
I wanna see if I can finish at least with one perfect week. A perfect day is I earn all my check marks. I created my short, I created my long format video, I practiced the guitar for 20 minutes, I ate under 2,500 calories. I had a, another interesting observation. I made a short on my 90 day transformation. I just went back to my 90 day transformation video and I edited it into a one minute short. That short got 2,300 views in a couple of hours. It is the fastest viewed video of any video I've ever made. And ironically, the 90 day transformation video that I made it from, it's like a 17 minute video. That video was my biggest video ever for a long format video. And it got me to a point where it was getting 1500 views a day. Two things, it made me think there may be something magic about a 90 day transformation because both videos I've done that had the words 90 day transformation in the title have been my most viral videos of any videos I've made. I made a few other shorts after that that I was just as excited about. Like I made a short on my 120 day transformation and I thought it was really good. I went to the gym, I went home, I got home and made my dinner and I was so excited to check and see how many views that video got to see if it got another 2000 views like the last one. I kind of felt like a teenage kid who couldn't wait to get home to check their social media to see how many people liked their last post. But when I got on, it only got 40 views in like six hours. So I do realize now that just cause I'm excited and I think a video is going to do well, that does not mean anything. It's hard to predict which ones are going to do good and which ones won't. But I do need to make another 90 day transformation video. My next video, I'm going to make it on the thing I want to make videos on more than anything else. And that is training in my garage gym. So I'm going to do some more research, try to find, the best garage gym training videos out there that is gonna give me the best chance to get traffic to my website and more subscribers. And I'm gonna crank that out next. Um, other than that, everything's going good. The transformation is still on track. I am uh, dieting like a beast, training six days a week. That wraps up the fourth vlog. Keep grinding, more cool stuff to come. Peace.